وعباد الرحمن وعباد الرحمن الذين يمشون على الأرض هونا وإذا خاطبهم الجاهلون قالوا سلاما والذين يبيتون لربهم سجدا وقياما when the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu or even we go back to Musa alayhi salam, this is in the Old Testament, and again we believe in all the scriptures of old, of old, we believe in all the prophets. When Musa alayhi salam went to Mount Sinai, and he saw the burning bush, he saw the light, and Allah spoke to him. Right? Musa alayhi salam said, Oh Allah, I want to see you. Let me see you. I hear you talking to me, but let me see you. What did Allah say? Allah said, look at this mountain. I'm going to show my jalala. Right? I'm going to show my magnitude. I'm going to show my grace to this mountain. And so when Allah, Allah showed his jalala, his magnificence to the mountain, we're told that the mountain blew up. Boom. It exploded. And Musa al Islam fell into a swoon and was not unconscious. When he woke up, he said, praise be to thee. Right? If you do not forgive me, I will be doomed. Right? And barely I'll be of the wrongdoers. I'll be of those who have sinned. Oh Allah, forgive me for this. For asking something that I have no knowledge of. So Allah told Musa as the law, this is to let you know that no man can see God and live. No man can see God and live. So thus Musa as the law did not see God. When the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa made the Iraj, and this is something that the Muslims believe in. The Prophet made a journey to the heavens. Okay? This is another subject. We're told that after he went through the seven heavens, and he came to the highest part, right? And Allah spoke to him and revealed to him, or laid down the foundations or the commandment of doing a salat, right? The Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, he said he saw nur ala nur, light upon light. The Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam, he spoke to Allah, but he never seen Allah. Aisha, who was the wife of the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu she said, if there's anyone who said that the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa seen Allah, they are a liar. Anyone who claims that the Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa said that they seen Allah, that he seen Allah, is a liar. This goes with all those other uh, heretic sects, or those who have imams or shuyuk or sheikhs who say they talk to Allah, or they see Allah, a stuff for Allah. Nobody can see Allah. When they asked the Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, what did he see? He said, Nur Allah Nur, light upon light. Nobody can see Allah, so therefore Allah is unseen.